failed that interview and I didn't get my dream job of writing Spring Boot apps. What? Spring Boot Learning just released a video about this? To interview like a pro, it's important to give them what they want. Experience. Check out this scenario. Um, uh, have I worked with Vue.js? Uh, no. Hold on. It's true, I haven't worked with Vue.js. But technology-specific skills can be learned. Indicating an ability to learn new technologies is valuable. Can we try that again? I don't know Vue.js, but I worked on a React.js front end in order to provision services with the Cloud Foundry system. Always look for a real life example of something you did or something you learned that's related, even if it's remotely related. Keep the conversation moving. It's also important to know the trade. Interviewers will be listening to see if you know industry acronyms, terms, and concepts. If you're just out of college, the expectations will certainly be different. If you know the answer, give it. If not, just be honest and say you don't know. So what you're saying is that instead of panicking at the first sign of not knowing something, to instead come up with an example where you were successful. That's right. Some companies may already ask questions like, what's an example of a problem that you solved? It's good to go ahead and think about those situations. Oh, you mean like, what's the hardest problem you ever solved? Or, what's the most recent tech that you ever worked with? And perhaps, what's the situation when you had to partner with a colleague to fix something? Those are perfect examples to go ahead and research ahead of any interview. It's important to understand that you're interviewing them as well. Asking questions about the work environment, the benefits, and equity are okay. And even if you don't get an offer, these tactics will help you continue to interview and hopefully someday get that dream position. Thanks, I know what I need to do now, but not until I go watch this video about how to polish code and make it sparkle.